swapping. One click swap replaces any object with any other object. This is totally worth jumping out and showing you guys exactly how this works. Just a moment. All right, swap. Here we go. All right, Nick. So we have businessman being swapped for hipster, but instead I want something else. I don't okay. even want a character. No, no, forget it. Um, what well, about? First of all, I just want to note, I selected my character by clicking on him here. Again, I can click down here and get him as well. And then you see this guy swap. It's right in the quick menu, or you can find it here as well in the main menu. Swap. And this opens up it automatically goes to characters, but like we said, we don't want to swap this with a character. We you can want, swap it for anything. I want to swap it for a prop. And How about a, a coffee cup? Yeah. How about cups? Coffee. coffee cup. I mean, if we're talking hipster. Uh, right? Got to have coffee. All right. So how about this, this guy? This blue guy. I yeah. love this guy right here. So in one click, I'm just going to replace. See? There we go. And if you notice down here, uh, the entrance effect, the time on stage, its location on stage, everything is preserved from your original object. It just swaps it out with your new object. So one click, it's so easy. That's something you can do to personalize, to customize a template so that it looks original. It's something you can do if, let's say, you know, you just aren't happy with the characters you're using or anything like that. It just opens up so much flexibility. Exactly. It changes, the whole scene is changing. It's like, could you swap backgrounds? All right, let's take a look here. So background and oh, sure enough, swap. So instead of going through and clicking on backgrounds on the side and going through them, you can type whatever you want and all the backgrounds are lined out there for you. So let's swap it with a, uh, an, uh, an urban background, right? We're talking hipsters right. anyway. And these are actually video backgrounds right here. Really oh. exciting stuff. That's okay. We're gonna we're gonna talk a little bit more exactly about how to handle. I was these. gonna go picture. Wasn't gonna go video no, yet. But let's okay, go video. But these are really cool. So we're gonna just as just like with the still images. If you hold your mouse over one of these, then it should load a preview for you right there, uh, and that gives you a sense of it. Now you'll notice this this clip is 13 seconds long, and our slide is only five seconds long. We're gonna see exactly what that does when we choose that. Just one moment. So you'll notice uh, a couple of things. First of all, we have this time indicator, 0 through 5 of 13 seconds. And you'll also notice the rest of the seconds of this video, it spit out onto a new slide here, just inserted this slide. We don't want to change the timing of our overall presentation, so we're just going to delete that slide. You know what I think would look good here? Maybe we're going a little off script. But okay. I think you should put an opacity box Let's here. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'll show you exactly how to do that. Go to Shapes. I'm going to click one of these shapes, and it's just going to drop it right on my stage. Ooh, come on. Oh, I did not mean to do that. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah, let's make it the whole bottom of the screen. Let's make it the whole bottom of the screen. So here's what I'm going to do. If this thing would cooperate. Cooperation. Cooperation. Very important. Zero. There between we go. Between people and between programs. Yes. Yes. <laughs> we love it. Okay. So I'm just making this guy a little bit bigger and making this guy a little bit bigger. All right, and you guys feel free to ask questions. Uh, I, we're reading them the, during the presentation. Of course, afterwards, if we don't get to it, these are a lot of questions, so just feel free to ask anything, and we'll try to address everything and answer you during the course of the webinar. So as you see, what I've done there is I've just taken the, op the opacity down, made it a little more transparent, and the other thing I want to do, I'm just going to click out of that and get back to my settings is I'm going to arrange, I'm going to move this all the way to the back. Yeah, you see how everything looks shadowy? We want to, we want to, there. there we go. There we go. And I can just go ahead and bring this right up to here. Boom. There we go. Let's take a look and see what this looks like if we just play this one scene. Do, 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 do. Waiting for Powtoon to play. <laughs> this is our waiting for Powtoon to play song. <laughs> Indeed. Okay. There we go. This is what it looks like. All right. Look so how pro. Look how pro that looks. Swapping. You can swap your background. You can swap your objects. You can do anything you want. I feel like I'm watching a commercial click. for Starbucks. It's so. It's amazing. It's amazing.